We'll be installing the Tape Tech and Asgard Finishing Box Wheel Replacement Kit number 502CN. Again, for reference, there's a lot of boxes on the back here, both Tape Tech and Asgard branded. I'll show you how to install this kit. So in this kit, you have several parts. Um, let's set these out here. You have the wheel itself with an O-ring already installed. You have a couple spare O-rings. You have the, the bolt itself, the axle bolt. There's two of those. You have two nylon liners, one for each side, and I'll show you how to install these, and then two washers, brass washers. Okay, so that's inside this kit. You won't be needing these. These are just spares, so you keep those as, as, as spares if you need them in the future. So again, on the Asgard product and the Tape Tech product, you have different axles. So the newer Tape Tech, you have the wheels for bead. And on the Asgard, you just have a, a basically a, just the wheels themselves, and they're not designed to run bead. So on the older style Tape Techs, you can't install this kit onto the newer style. You have to get an axle kit and everything. The whole, the whole thing has to be changed out. So this can't be just changed. You just can't put these wheels onto this because they wouldn't, they wouldn't align. So, but the Asgard, this tool here in particular, has the old style axle. And what we can do is, I think it's a 5 8 inch nut driver, 3 8 I'm sorry, 3 8 Turn this, just loosen that up, unthread. We're going to take these parts off. Be careful of the parts so you don't lose them. And again, I take them off in order. So you have the washer. This one's pretty simple. You have the wheel. And inside the wheel, there's a nylon liner. If I can pop it out. It always gets stuck in there. There's a little nylon liner piece there and then the wheel itself. So you have basically four pieces. So as you take them apart, remember them because that's how you're gonna put it back together. With anything, it's a good practice. So again, we just take the nylon liner, put it onto the bolt itself, install it onto the wheel, put the washer on here, and then tighten it up this side as well. Using the nut driver works the best. Just tighten this up really easy. It's pretty easy repair to do. Tighten that nice and firm, make sure it's spinning good. Uh, repeat the same on the other side, and that's how you change out the uh, wheel kit on this uh, Asgard and Tape Tech, uh, older Tape Techs, but with Asgard, that's how you change the wheels out.